of your party then, Damo. What are the Greens, perhaps, you're saying? What have they said about all of this? Well, the Green Party didn't wait for this latest atrocity to happen before issuing a statement on all of this. And the Green Party co-leader Carla Denyer issued such a statement following the UN Security Council ceasefire vote last week. And the Greens' position is a very clear one. The Green Party has been calling for a ceasefire since last October, so this vote is hugely welcome if long overdue. With Israel's greatest ally, the United States, abstaining, the Netanyahu regime is more isolated than ever, and rightly so. This Security Council resolution comes too late for hundreds of thousands of people who have seen their families and friends killed, maimed or seriously injured, and their homes, hospitals and schools destroyed. Nonetheless, it ramps up international pressure on Israel to end its deadly assault on Gaza. However, Netanyahu is not listening. The attacks continue. 